next thing we're going to talk about is secretion clearance. You really need to feel this to see how it works. Hopefully this will do it. So this is a chest physiotherapy tool. We, the device oscillates at a high frequency, which creates a back and forth gas flow over the secretions. It's the same thing that VEST tells you, but this is much more intense. With VEST, it's positive pressure, striking the chest wall over and over again at a high rate. This is a pull and a push. So with positive pressure against the chest wall over time, you actually will see decrease in residual volume. With this, the volume is maintained. So we get a negative and positive uh, back and forth gas flow. But what really sets us apart after we thin the secretions out and bring them up to the large airways with this intense oscillation, then it cycles into a cough assist. So now it's going to give a strong, long, deep breath and a sharp, short exhalation. The patient can cough with it and get dramatic increases in cough flow. If they're incapable of coughing with it, they still get a cough flow that they would never be able to obtain otherwise. Usually for CFRs and this is the real thick secretion for running at about this frequency, up to 800. That's kind of the therapeutic range. If you'll oscillate as high as 12 minutes cycle per minute, that's so fine, it doesn't have as much effect on the uh, thinning the secretion. If you go any slower, it becomes ventilation and you get dizzy. So now it's going to switch over to cough assist. It's inflating his lung right now. Now, this is, the way it cycles is sort of, I, can, I count it like you would, I don't know, APRV on a positive pressure ventilator. If he breathes spontaneously, it's not going to hurt anything. He might, it, eventually he'll wear out with fighting it, but he can breathe at his own rate as it cycles. But what we try to do is get the patient to cough with it. I'll coach the patient as it's pushing, one, two, three, and I'll get him to cough with that positive pressure breath. And you just get this dramatic increase in cough flow. And we've seen in trials patients that have been non productive for days doing IPV and doing VEST. You put this on, when it gets to that cough assist cycle, if there's anything down there to be brought up, 